I've heard a lot of great things about you. Uh, obviously, I want to wish you all the best and also wish you luck with uh, the US national team. We'll be waiting here for you, Ian.
any coach that's going to get him is going to have a player that says, yes, coach, and then moves forward. Grades on the field, doesn't matter. Specifically, I think the thing that, that's going to stand out to other coaches as he goes to the next level is his mentality that he brings. Calm and cool and collected, and not panic while you're playing. Um, and Ian is definitely a player like that. He's definitely that, that player that you want in the middle of the field, that, that type of commander with the ball that's going to dictate the, the pace, um, dictate the, the style of play when, when he's in the game. Actually, you know, wherever he goes and, and plays beyond, um, he's going to be a pleasure for, for any coach that picks him up. You know, I'm excited for, for what's to come for him. One, one of the players that we uh, found last year in an ID clinic was uh, Ian Flores. Uh, Ian did a great job in the ID clinic, stood out in how he moved through the ball, uh, very, very good vision, uh, was very, very active, so it was very, very interesting for us. Ian did a fantastic job over the summer, uh, playing very, very good in eight games against Bundesliga teams like um, MSV Duisburg, like Düsseldorf, like FC Cologne. So uh, the level of players that he played against was extremely high. And Ian had a chance to train for 10 days with uh, the U16 boys team at 18-16 Munich under Filip Tapalovic. I've watched it a couple times. He, he, pound for pound, he's one of the best players you got. He wins balls in the air, he works hard. You know, it's a good little, good little defensive team. But he made, it, he made it happen for you, so it's good stuff. to see who, who really stood out. Ian was really a, an exceptional young man. Um, he has great uh, character. He has great uh, team building skills. He works well with his teammates. He always has a smile on his face. Uh, he always found, found ways to pick up his teammates in a very soft and, and subtle way. He was, when he was ready to speak, everybody kind of stopped and, and listened to Ian and took Ian's instruction. I'm very proud to, to see where he has come as a player and look forward to seeing where he goes with the game. He's one of the top players in the county without a question. One of the top midfielders, I think, in the state. Um, but also one of those players that has opportunities outside of here because of the love he's playing. He's got letters, or phone calls, we'll get phone calls from college coaches. Right? Notre Dame is contacting him. West Point is contacted. There's a number of schools that I don't even couldn't even name all the names of the schools that are interested in Ian right now. Uh, he's a great player. I thought for a second I might, you know, we might lose you next year. We still could because there are places overseas that may look at. Him. Um, fortunately, he was one of the first players that we've ever had as a junior that also this year was selected as All State. We actually went to Germany to train in Germany, and we had a great time over there. Uh, they could have kept him and signed him over there, but wouldn't have got him back. Taking over as a central midfielder for us, uh, mostly attacking at times, and then we moved to the defensive, distributes the ball outstanding. Um, his vision of the field is fantastic. The touch is great. Uh, probably a higher level overall player than, than we've had here at Wirecraft. Very ability and potential. He gets bigger, stronger, faster. Uh, he's doing things now that a lot of players can't do. Right? The technical ability, the vision on the field, the soccer knowledge, uh, he can go a long way. Right? Four flats and two up top. But the two up top Ian, I'm gonna put you up top with Diego. Just be, be around. When, when we play to Diego, be close by, not so, so he far. Can lay it so back, he can lay it so what, you what, when the ball comes to Diego, pop, you're close. So we play you, one, and two. then we can go wide, or we can all. Uh, I want Kobe get involved. So, so four, 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 two. So it's a four, four, two, just like that. Four, four, two. So, but no, Ian is gonna be more. Ian is gonna be playing around, uh, around Diego too. So he can, he can lay the ball. Pop, two, and he will be the target. Uh, uh, if he, if uh, he is the target, come uh, underneath yeah, him. Yeah. So, come underneath yeah, him, so he can lay back. Yeah, yeah. If you are sometimes the highest player, it's okay with you. If you go on the back four and you're huh. the highest, I mean, first they can ball, play you in, and then he can run off you. You play Diego in. You understand that? And the guy comes in and takes it. He just him because he has more speed, he has more physical. Eight, you, know, you need to get the ball to the feet. Out. I don't want him in the space. Him to the feet, guys, okay? Play him to feet. 